so close, yet so very, very far. <clears throat> we're close, though. Oh, no, we're actually close. It's not very, very far. It's less than 24 hours away. I can't wait. Uh, but I do have two other things I'm going to stream instead. Uh, it's been a few days since my last uh, stream. Uh, after I finished uh, Somnium Files, I was like, uh, I'll do more streams. Uh, with the late shift at work that I'm working on, I'll do streams during the day. And then uh, things happened. Uh, if you didn't notice, the world's kind of gone to absolute shit in the last week. So many, many changes of plans are going to happen. And uh, I could probably still just stream at night for the time being, even with the late schedule. And it turns out the late schedule might be permanent, which might not, which might affect things in the long run. Uh, but you know. It is what it is. Anyway, Charles Amana comes out next month. A demo came out yesterday, I think? I was probably working while it came out. Which, by the way, working from home, pretty neat. Uh, it's definitely a challenge. Or not really. It's actually... It's weird. It, it feels busier, but it's also like... I'm just sit I don't know. I'm mixed. I'm mixed on it. I can't form a coherent opinion about that. Anyway, Trials of Mana comes out next month. Save data can transfer over from this, so why not? That's going to be a full stream game, too. What I might do is I might stream this and then upload this when the full version comes out next month. That way, all the parts are pretty close to each other. So this is uh, Trials of Mana. It's a remake of Seiken Densetsu 3, which everyone pretty much knows by this point. Uh, I stream that, I actually stream that like on my, uh, oh, that's loud. I actually stream that on uh, my, like my first stream anniversary, because I streamed Secret of Mana when I first started streaming. And then they remade Secret of Mana and it wasn't good. So I didn't play that. And now they remade Seiken Densetsu 3, and that was good, so I'll play it. That was good. I don't know if this remake's gonna be good. As in the full version, you may choose a main character and two companions from any of the six options. You can transfer your save data from the demo into the full version. You can only level up to level 7 in the demo. You will be able to play the beginning of the story. Alright, sounds pretty, uh... substantial, for a demo at least. Not as substantial as the Dragon Quest XI demo, which I never finished. I actually, like, got, like, an hour, not even an hour, like, 20 minutes into it, and I stopped. Alright, game uses autosave. When the world was shrouded in darkness. I think I remember reading this in the SNES version, and I messed up the first line. The goddess of mana drew forth the sword of mana to smite the eight Benevodins, monsters of destruction. She sealed the horrors inside the eight mana stones, bringing the realm back from the brink. Oh, this is nice. Oh, wow. This looks very good for a Switch game. Weak from rebuilding the world, the goddess changed into a tree. Into a tree? Into a tree and fell fast asleep for years. However, the forces of evil sought to free the Benevodons to gain control of the world. They started a terrible war to further their plot and destabilize the kingdoms. Peace was at an end. Oh, I love that. I'm assuming that's the jungle area from uh, the other game. Or from the first, whatever. Mana itself began to disappear from the world and the mana tree to wither. I remember there being like a jungle temple in Seiken and Setsu 3, and it was very nice thematically. And if that's the area that I'm thinking of, then it's gonna be pretty cool to see that in 3D. It's funny, I'm actually looking forward to this more than Final Fantasy VII Remake, because I don't think I'm going to be playing Final Fantasy VII Remake. Hmm. 
Maybe I will. I don't know. If I do, I'm probably not going to stream it. I still have to finish streaming Kingdom Hearts 3 at some point. I stopped in the middle of that game. Excuse me while I hydrate a bit. Gotta stay hydrated, babies. Of bizarre that this game is even happening, honestly. It just doesn't feel real. Trials of Mana. Uh, sorry, but I gotta go with English. BGM Audio Sus Remake Original? Oh! Oh, that's really good. Squeenix, you done good. Still, I th this remake music does sound really good, and I'm looking forward to hearing it. Tech speed, auto progression, instant. I guess auto progression. Adjust the speaker display for cutscenes. Subtitles on. Camera adjust. Uh, I don't know. We'll have to futz with that in-game. Vibration on. Battle animations on. Rotate mini-map. Leave that off. Mini-map display on. Mission display. Control display. Brightness, control settings, copyrights. Just the brightness so that the left and right images are visible. I mean, they look fine here. Yeah, we can just leave them on default. Difficulty settings can be changed during day and play. Difficulty has no bearing on the story. Normal difficulty. Challenging difficulty setting for action game pros. Epic gamers. Uh, easy difficulty setting for those who find action games a little hard. Beginner difficulty setting for those who wish to focus on the story. You can resume in the same spot no matter how many times you get a game over. Let's just stick with media. Uh, with normal. I don't have the patience to crank an RPG up to hard and then have to grind for countless hours. Main character, companion, one... Comp okay, so they're very clear that, uh... that this is gonna be, uh, you're picking the main character right now. Duran, Angela, Kevin? Charlotte, Hawkeye, that's who I played as last time, I think? And Rise. I think I played as three, these three last time. Kind of just uh, tells you their stats. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I have to look it up. Who did I, who did I play as when I first uh, played through this? I'm pretty sure it was the three on the right. me. Shush past me. Carly? Is that really what they- Elise. L-I-C-E. L-I-S-E. Oh, it actually says in the original version, select a main character. So I think I picked Hawkeye. Yep, I picked Hawkeye, Lees, and uh, Charlotte. 
or, or Carly, as she was called back then. See, I, I picked the three on the right. Hawkeye was my main. The thing is, you don't just pick a main character, because if I'm not mistaken, one of the other secondary characters has their story tied to them. So, like, I picked Hawkeye and Reese because both of their stories tie together. And then I just picked uh, Charlotte as the final one. So we know about these three. Uh, who do we, who connects over here? does have some decent differences, different stories, plots. There's not much difference depending on the dialogue. So Carly and Kevin, or Charlotte and Kevin, have this have a linked story, which means I should pick um, Duran and Angel as my two main characters, or one of them is the main character. Because if I pick Kevin as the main character, then he's not going to get as much story. Duran Angela plot path has the main storyline plot-wise, with Duran especially, won't spoil why. Sorry, I was looking at the, uh, post I was looking at. So as vanilla as it is, I might go with Duran as the main character. Duran is a proud young soldier from Valsena, Kingdom of the Plains. Though he came- though he comes across as hot-headed and ready for a fight, the whole kingdom acknowledges his skill with the blade. Duran has nothing but love for his kingdom and respect for the Hero King, a good friend of his departed father, Loki, the Golden Knight. Weapon Swords, Bio, High Attack, Power, and Defense with Shield, Home, Valsena, Strength B, Stamina A, Intellect E, so he's the basic fighter. I'm a soldier from Valsena. The name's Duran. Nice to meet you, Duran. Angela. Angela is the only daughter of the true queen of Altena, the snow-covered kingdom of magicians. Because Angela's mother hardly spent any time with her as a child, the princess was prone to act out to get attention, wearing gaudy clothes, gaudy, excuse me, clothes, and playing pranks on people in the castle. Despite this, her love for her... Her love for her mother runs deep. Angela never got the hang of casting magic spells, a problem that plagues her to this day. Which is weird, because she's the magic user. Wands, ranged magic and mass targeting spells, home Altena. I'm tempted to play as her as the main character, but at the same time, it's like, not really worth it. I'm Angela, Princess of Altena. Kevin is heir to the throne of Ferolia. He, those are the animal people, right? His father is the king of the beast men. Yep. But, oops. But his missing mother was a human woman. Kevin's father raised him to be a fighting machine, which affected his social skills. He is unused to com he is unused to conversing with humans, which can make him hard to understand at times. The ice around the young boy's heart only began to melt after making friends with Carl, the wolf pup. Kevin, that's me. Fists, high attack, and nighttime transformation. Wait, oh, the time of the day actually like affects his form? That's cool. Was it like that in the original game? Also, you can't name the characters here for obvious reasons. Silver and gold mana statues. Interact with silver mana statues to save your game. Gold mana statues will restore your HP and MP. I suppose there's an extra special mana statue somewhere in this world. I don't know what that one means, but uh, yep. Gold and silver, that's typical fare for uh for the mana series. Duran, hey, you're up. <laughs> Pull yourself together. Look at that strut. Sorry, I peeked the microphone there. Commence the final match for the Sword Mastery Tournament Youth Division. Combatants, forward! <laughs> I'll break you like a dry noodle. Give it a try. I dare you. Uh, did it? Whoa, whoa! What just happened there? This father just had poppin'. <laughs> Weak attack. Hit your enemy with quick attacks. Okay, camera's good. Why evade? You can just roll. Hit your enemy with a single strong blow. Wait, what? Oh, okay. 
almost done. I can do this. Oh, I see. They consider this a different move. Collect particles to increase your CS gauge. Wait, what? Whoa, 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 what is this? Hold L plus Y, Clash Strike, CS Gauge 100% or higher. Take down an enemy with a special attack. That's interesting. I don't remember this. Ooh. I'm already liking this better than the original, honestly, in terms of gameplay. Champion You've come far in your training, lad. Imagine if the match Duran, soldier from Balsena, Kingdom of the Plains. His father Loki, the Golden Knight, and friend to the hero king Richard, went missing when the young soldier was but a child. His mother succumbed to sickness and grief, leaving him and his younger sister Wendy to their aunt Stella. Like his father before him, the boy could not deny the pull of the blade. From a young age, he outshone all other swordsmen, and eventually came to be in service to the king himself. Imagine the guy being in, sh like, the, the final opponent of the biggest fight of your life is just a tutorial battle. Man, I'm beat. He uses you as, as target practice. Hang in there. The next shift is on its way. Hmm. I'll do one more round in the meantime. Why does your helmet sound like it has a, a microphone in it? Sword's glitching through his hair. Gotta restart. No, seriously, though, that's a joke we would make about one of my friends. Any game with a creative character, if the hair glitched the clothes, he'd be like, I'd redo it. Doesn't look right. Papa, where are you going? Off to slay some dragons. The fearsome beast known as the Dragon Lord is the strongest of its kind. But don't worry. His Highness and I won't lose. It's gonna be kind of weird playing this and then having to go back to it in a month after doing only one, like, one stream of it. Understood, son. I will. Bye bye. Several months later. Madam, your husband, Loki, he took a blow meant for me. Causing both him and the Dragon Lord to fall into the depths of an abyss. The shock was so heavy my it blew my texture blew my textures off. The area for a week, but to no avail. We could not find Loki. I see. He fulfilled his duties as the Golden Knight until the very end. I'm sure that's what he would have wanted. Simone, my lady. No. Oh, Stella. How could you let your illness go untreated for so long, Simone? If Loki knew I was ill. He would have neglected his duties for my sake. I just couldn't hold him back like that. No. You're, you're both such fools. Stella. Topical. My children. Do not fret, Simone. I will take care of them as if they were my own. And unlike you, I will make you them wash have... their hands. Sorry, I'm ruining I'm ruining the, the sad moment. Speaking of 
It's really hard to get a word in here because everything's voiced. Shouldn't be sleeping on the job. Come on, don't give in. Kind of oddly worded what there, but here? whatever. Huh? What's that? Chase after the interloper. Oh, good, the ring menu's back. Ugh, I'm not a fig I'm honestly not a fan of the ring menu. Ring menu, up and down. So it's moves. Items. Okay, you could scroll through them. Oh, there's two. All right. Set shortcut. Oh, that's what the uh, the R button's for. Interesting. Map. Valsenia. Valsenia, the Kingdom of the Plains. Shade Time, Monaday. map. Oh, map info is hidden, only mission info is displayed. Okay, I see how this works. Organize your ring item from the Ming menu. Organize your ring menu from the item menu. Press that. You remember that on the field ring battle, you can only use the 12 different item commands that are set to the ring menu. You can stock on uh, nine, up to 9 of each. Okay. Alright, so this is pretty, um... Pretty much the same as it was. Locked to class. Interesting. Oh yeah, I remember those now. Quick leap forward followed by a damaging cross slash. Oh, that's what CS stands for. Clash strikes. Okay. Locked abilities. Costume. Neat. Training? Use the training points you obtain after leveling up to learn moves and abilities to increase your stats. Moves. Magic spells and attacks you learn will be automatically added to the move ring menu. Press the down. They actually mean down on the control pad because I'm using the pro controller. To bring up the menu and select a move while exploring the field or battling. Using moves costs MP. Ah. Uh. Ah, I see. Alright. That's 2% of CS gauge when receiving damage. Space spirit increased by 5. Okay, so this is a little different from how it works. From how it worked, rather. Strategy. Target other enemy target enemies not targeted by allies. Nearby enemies, range enemies, same enemy. Tactics, focus on attacking. Protection exclusive. Alright, I see. So it just it's just kind of the balance between healing and uh, attacking. Use moves without M without MP falling below 75%. <coughs> oh cool, so if you're if they're computer controlled, they'll they'll uh they'll just go all at it. Press dash L in to change your traveling speed. Press it again to switch back to normal. Once you press dash once, you don't have to keep pressing the button to stay speedy. Interesting. Uh, yep. Silver and monogold statues, we already know that. Okay, just overlay, overlays their stats. 
the options menu. Okay, be self-explanatory. Yeah, no, we've seen that already. So wait. Okay, so you could sprint, but like the second you stop moving, you'd. Oh wait, no, never mind. I don't know what. That's weird. Yeah, I guess you just stop moving. Oh, there's an auto save, right? You jumpies. I don't know what use that is, but you can do it. The illusion of destructible environments. Is that no, it's nothing. Okay. That's something though. No, never mind. It's nothing. It's also nothing. What's his name? Halt! Who are you? <laughs> you are sharper than you look. <laughs> What's so funny? The fact that you are considered the best fighter in this miserable castle. I think it's time I show you how powerless you really are. No more talking! Uh-oh. Senile old fool would entrust the security of the castle to a child. Oh, my apologies. You work for the king, do you not? What? Don't you dare insult his majesty! Is that Bryce Pappenbrook? It kind of sounds like him. Now the finishing blow! Someone infiltrated the castle. Find them. I mean, if you uh, <sighs> seems you'll live another day. No matter. If all the king can boast is soldiers of your caliber, we can take this kingdom anytime we choose. Uh, what? Wait, but you literally took me down without any effort. You could take down another two guards uh, easily. Uh, Last night, an unknown wizard managed to penetrate our defenses. The soldiers on duty were no match for him. Duran was the only survivor. They switched between yeah. Duran and Duran. Oh my god, that poppin' was, was so weird. Red cloak. It has to be that Altinish cur. The crimson wizard. You mean Altinus <laughs> and a spy? <laughs> no honor among the lot of them. We should mount a full-scale attack on their forces before they sneak in again. Who's mount. with me? Right! Hold! Yes, mount those forces. There is <clears throat> no definitive proof that Altena sent the intruder. Nor would they have reason to attack our kingdom in the first place. We cannot act rashly. I don't think it's a matter of we argument. They just Someone just read the name differently when they were recording. Defenses, and some of our best soldiers. If we act hastily, we could fall into our enemy's trap. Perhaps. First, we must strengthen the castle's defenses and increase the guard. Then we shall send our own spies into Altanish territory. Yes, sir. But 
Why would the true queen of Altena attack Valsena of all places? Isn't she just straight up evil? I can barely remember this game. Yeah, but you'll Are get you better. Listening to me? Stop whining and listen! I hate you! Wendy! Wait. Explore the surrounding town. My brother was there that night, the night that Crimson Scoundrel came and... Oh. Wait a minute. Can I... Let me float. Can't. There are soldiers on guard all over the town. I have never seen it like this. Little sister is out looking for you. You shouldn't make her worry. Go home. What's this I hear about a war? Is it true? You're a soldier. You must know something. Leave security to us. Ass people. His Majesty the King will take care of the Altenish Kerr. Mark my words. How's that injury? His Majesty was asking. I still can't believe the interloper got the better of someone as good as you. Don't let that crimson wizard get you down. Come out dancing with me instead. Jump. Whining, huh? I walk around town, might clear my head some. Not big, but what do those little green dots mean? Are they just NPCs? I think they are. Yep. I am collecting goods for the castle. I do not want to sit oddly by in times like these. Doing okay? Don't worry about the castle. We could handle it while you rest up. I will say, you do kind of move along very slowly if you're not dashing. I just plot along. The game does look pretty good. I'm very much enjoying it. Alright, so that's good. So things you could break are clearly, like, more opaque, I guess, would be the term. Night patrols are no joke ever since that intruder snuck in. No one does allowed outside the town at night. King's orders. Kitty. Your father, the Golden Knight Loki, was struck down by the Dragon Lord while protecting his majesty. I know you can live up to his name. Medical herb. Ooh, 
that's not good. Look at that. Just... Ah! It, like, phases into existence. Night patrols were no joke ever since that intruder snuck in. No one is allowed outside the town at night. King's orders. Wow, just like real life, only all the time instead of just at night. What's this I hear about a war? Is it true? You're a soldier, you must know something. Night patrols are no joke. Okay, you say the same exact thing. I keep wanting to hit Y to attack. Let him swim, damn it. Let me guess, night patrols? Oh no. If our star soldier is no match for the enemy, how are we to protect this town? Yet. Can I open this door? No. How's that injury? His Majesty was asking. Still can't believe that interloper got the better of. Wait, we already. A lot of these NPCs just kind of say the same thing, huh? Alright, so doors that can be opened have a hand symbol. It's not my place to tell a soldier what to do, but your aunt and little sister have been worried. Perhaps you should go home tonight. If you find a seed, try planting it in at an inn. Excuse me. Try planting it in an inn's magic pot located near the front desk. You can grow items and equipment from the various types of seeds. The pot will level up the more seeds you plant. The higher your magic pot level is, the better your chance of getting good items from item seeds. Enemies will drop seeds more often, too. I remember not being a fan of that, because I never used it. There was quite a mess at the castle. The owner said not to go outside. Here I was on my way to the east port of Maya, but then I remembered we can't go outside the city at night. <coughs> that old fortune teller was right. I must go back for more guidance. What does that star mean exactly? Surprised there's a demo. Me too. I'm not, I'm not just surprised there's a demo. I'm surprised it came out a month before the game does. Square Enix is very confident in this game. Valsena, Kingdom of the Plains. My son was guarding the castle the night that wizard attack. I uh, the. My son was guarding the castle the night that wizard attacked. I suggest you leave. If he had joined the Valsenen ranks, he, he never would have... Yo, not to be uh, rude, but that is some banging looking cheese and soup you got there. Can I just, you know, have some? When's my brother coming home? You can't leave town. There are dangerous people out there. Oh, that's sad. Wait, what did I get eight lucre for? Or lucre? I don't know if it's lucre or lucre. Oh, 
chest. Spell all ally magic effects. Interesting. wizard out there. I barely want to leave the house, let alone this town. Oh, wizard. Ooh, another chest. Leave security to us. There's dangerous people out there. Your father, the Golden Knight Loki, was struck down by the Dragon Lord while protecting his majesty. I know you could live up to his name, even though someone else said this exact same thing earlier. There's soldiers on guard all over the town. I've never seen it like this. Why do they cram so many NPCs into a building if they're just going to make them all repeat their dialogue? Oh, it's been so long. You've become such a strong soldier like your father. Father. Flavor text. See, that's the other thing, too. Most of this is just flavor text, and yet it's repeating among multiple people. Maybe if this sells well, Chrono Live Alive? That's what I'm thinking, honestly. I'm hoping that this isn't necessarily signs of them doing more mana games. Rather, it's going to be a sign of them doing the rest of the SNES, like, non-Final Fantasy library. I think Live Alive would be a great game to get a remake next, just because A, the game was never released over here. B, it's a good premise overall. And C, uh, the game needs a remake. It's I, I played it, I streamed the fan translation. It was, I didn't have a lot of fun with it. It was very frustrating. And I think a remake could easily fix a lot of the problems in it. So I would definitely hope for a Live Alive remake next, and then I think it would culminate with, uh, with Chrono being the, uh, the final SNES remake. Like, it wouldn't be on the level of Final Fantasy VII remake, but I think Chrono remake would be a big deal for them. It would be, like, the culmination of all the SNES stuff. And then they can do, uh, Legend of Mana after that, which I know one person I know is, is very much looking forward to that. I know a certain someone who's been who's really hoping they do a, a Legend of Mana remake. Every soldier on duty was defeated by a single wizard. I doubt any of us are safe. The Crimson Wizard is legendary, but I would have never thought that a coward was a bloodthirsty spy. Oh, that that coward. He was talking about him specifically. They can't rely on Final Fantasy always, that we all know it. Yeah, no, I mean, this is, that's the thing. They totally could, especially with Final Fantasy XIV. That thing is a cash cow. They could, Square Enix could live off that. Just as goofy looking in 3D as they do in 2D. I know a soldier's work is dangerous, but losing anyone is heartbreaking. Now, if you excuse me, I gotta keep dancing. Evening, Duran. You at least made it out alive. I'm not liking how bad the pop-in is. Like, you saw there were bags on that shelf that popped in while, like, while I'm in that store. That's pretty bad technical-wise, but at the same time, the game runs pretty smoothly, so I can't really fault it. I've been told the loading times in this version are actually better than the PS4 version. Ooh, an item seed. Time to 
planet. Villainous Altenish wizard, I won't allow anyone past me next time. His Majesty the King will take care of that Altenish crap. Mark my words. I said the same thing again. For Lucre. I don't think the fans would enjoy if Square Enix just kind of relied on uh, Final Fantasy forever, but at the same time, I mean, let's be honest, as great as this looks and as great as this game might be, this game is totally getting overshadowed by Final Fantasy VII Remake, which, I mean, for good reason. Look at that game. It looks gorgeous. It looks amazing. I haven't tried the demo yet, but everyone that's played it says it's amazing. I'm looking forward to it, even if I might not get to play it, but I, I certainly can't... I, my biggest hope is that it just comes out on PC, because then I can play it on my own computer with max settings. I I got a, this, this computer I got last year, I've done nothing with it except stream... except use the capture card to stream Switch games. I have not streamed a single thing on this computer that I couldn't stream before on the laptop. This thing's ready for ray tracing, damn it. Uh, she just repeated a line that I've already heard. Naughty novel. Oops! Monster manual. It has information on everything from rabbites to mush booms. Some monsters are described. Some monsters are described in an ancient language. Can't read it. Really not liking the preciseness of the A button pressing. The mysteries of the mana stones. They're full of mystery. Also, not super big on the localization effort here. It feels a little stilted. Switching classes. Classes. A hidden power of some mana stones is the ability to draw out the latent abilities of adventurers seeking to switch their classes. Experience dictates that when one changes classes. Oh, experience dictates when one can change classes. Without a specified level of battle experience, 18 for class 2 and 38 for class 3, the adventurer cannot switch. Class 3 is the highest of the known classes. Its power is so great that Master Grand Croy sealed it away. Without a certain magical item, one cannot unlock the class. Very, uh, very gamey. See, that was something I liked about, um, the Bravely games, Bravely Default and Bravely Second. They actually worked the job switching into the story. What they did was there were these items called, uh, asterisks. And the thing is, you'd have to defeat someone who held one. And then if you grabbed it, you could just do their job. Or their class, rather. How can we rest easy when Castle Val- Castle? Good. When Castle Valsena itself was assaulted, I should ask the fortune teller. Head to the fortune teller. So I had to talk to two people who mentioned the same exact fortune teller in order to unlock that plot point. Huh. Doing okay. Don't worry about the castle. We can handle it while you rest up. Night Patrol is no joke. Night Patrols are no joke ever since that intruder snuck in. No one is allowed outside the town at night. King's orders. Ooh, perfect. Oh, they're the partial and full recovery options. Those are useful. Okay, don't worry about the castle. We can handle it while you rest up. You know it would be a good game to remake? The original Paper Mario. Yes, I agree. Huh. 
but part of me feels like they won't do that because I feel like in um in another year we're gonna get N64 games on uh, Nintendo Switch Online, and they'll probably just put it there. That said. One of my original- one of my ideas that I really wanted them to do was, um... Like an HD collection. So like, Paper Mario Remastered and then Thousand Year Door Remastered in like a single collection. I think that would have been a really cool idea. Do not lose yourself in your thoughts, Duran. Why not ask the fortune teller for guidance? Wait, what? Beware the guard dog. Oh, you want to go, huh? was on my way to the east port. <sighs> yeah, everyone's been saying that. <sighs> fortune telling. Said fortune readings, a look into your future. I don't know why I said just said fortune telling. <laughs> is for reading fortunes. Your pinched face tells me you have a lot on your mind, son. My what? People's lives are 99% destiny. But the rest of your future is always shaped by your will. Oh no. It's it is up to you to decide. We call that final 1%. Come now. <laughs> Anyone can see you bear a great burden. Let this old bird set you on the right path. Fortunes? Why would I trust my fate to something like that? All I believe in is strength. But I'll listen to what you have to say. <laughs> why, is, why is this just how to become more powerful? <laughs> why are his gestures so aggressive looking? No need for rudeness. <laughs> to become more powerful, you must head to Holy City Wendell. The Priest of Light can teach you how to switch your class. Why is that such a huge plot point right now? My class? Son, you listen and you listen good. Even a clueless fighter like yourself can eventually change to a better class. Now get out of my shop! Clueless, yet he's supposed to be the best fighter in the uh, country, so... What's going on here? Switching classes, huh? It means I can defeat that crimson jerk. I'll do anything. Well... Better head to Wendell, and see what all this fuss is about. <laughs> Plant that item seeds. Them seeds. Oh, you get it immediately, huh? Wow. Look at that microscopic amount of, uh, EXP I got for that. Honey Elixir recovers allies full HP. Oh boy. That's gonna be a hold on to that and never use it item. Something back here I missed. Two Luke Ray? Oh, another item seed.
Dryad icon. Oh, that uses a uh, Dryad magic, right? Okay, the, the menu thing is really confusing. Cancels out damage for one ally once. Wait, what? Oh, okay, that's cool. So it gives an it gives an ally a one hit shield. I just got an item from all the way up here. There's a chest over there. I'm finding all sorts of shit, huh? Fairy nut. Which covers allies MP by 50. I might actually, uh, hotkey that over the chocolate. Textures are pretty bad. That lousy, conniving, murderous, crimson wizard is dead meat. I won't let him get away. Not again. I won't come back until he's finished. Yeah, this game's being pretty generous, Walt. considering I'm still in the starting town. Leave Valsena. I came back to give a dramatic speech, and now I'm leaving. If I enjoy this remake enough, I might do a final playthrough of, like, the other story. The Kevin, uh, Wait. Carly story. Probably from Kevin's point of view, just because I've already played as Carly in the other one. Aunt Stella. Hey, V4. It's been a while. Here. I know you already have a bronze sword, but take this instead. Take two and call is me in the morning. This... This is the sword your father used when he was a young man. Back in the day, he even won the tournament with it, against the young king himself. Oh. Now be off. I'll explain the situation to Wendy, don't worry. Be sure to stop by the castle to see the king before you leave. That sword He's is huge. From you. How does he know? Don't be silly. He knew your father. Of course, the son of Loki would want to travel the world. I, why? I too knew this day would come. Uh. <coughs> I've raised you as if you were my Excuse only me. son, after all. Thanks, Aunt Stella. I'll be back. I promise. I feel like the hand gestures in this game are very, very exaggerated. Have I been? Um... Not dying, at least, which I guess is a good sign. Um, let's see, I finished AI Somnium Files last week. And, uh, and I kind of took the rest of the week off because I was on a new schedule, a new work schedule, and I'm still on it, but now I'm working from home, so I have no commute. So everything's just up in the air right now, and I just decided, you know what, I need to stream tonight. Because I wa really wanted to play this uh, demo of Trials of Mana. See, you're planning a journey, Dura. Your Majesty, forgive me. It was my weakness that allowed the enemy to escape so easily. I wish to atone for my mistakes. I cannot forgive the wizard for what he did. For the first time in my life, I was utterly powerless. He not only defeated me, he insulted you, my king. He must pay for this. I do not plan to return home until he has answered for these crimes. I cannot. All right, you're a teacher. I forgot about Acknowledged. that. Acknowledged. 
You have my blessing on your journey. Actually, I didn't forget. I just didn't think you'd be working from home. Thank you, your majesty. Oh. <coughs> His resolve is truly admirable. I had feared that perhaps he was raised too proud. But I see that he is just like his father at that age. Yes. Yes. What a mature young boy. How completely mature. Making vids, it's so weird. What grade do you teach again? My mom's an assistant administra uh, an administrative assistant at a school, and she's just been home the last few days, or she's gonna be home more days. Go due south to the port of Maya. From there, you can hitch a ride to Jad, and there's just a hop, skip, and jump to Wendell. Preschool. Oh wow! And they're actually making them do uh, video learning for preschool. Okay. You don't get a lot of horizontal distance when you're jumping. King was giving him the eye. Yeah, kinda. Don't worry about Stella or Wendy. We'll watch out for them. Who will watch out for you? Take care, Duran. We'll keep the king safe while you're gone. It's mostly directions for the current lessons. Oh, okay. When you level up, you receive training points. Access the training category from the main menu to allocate points towards learning your abilities and moves. For more details, check out the training menu. Yes! Oh, yes! I didn't think I'd be hearing this song so soon. This version of the song is really good. What? Oh, Luminatine. Undyne Day. Very snappy. Ooh. Up. Oh my god, this item acquiring is a little annoying. The vids are directed to the parents. Oh, okay. Dalsena, Kingdom of the Plains, Stone Split Gap. Bunnies, they're rabbites, they're evil, clearly. Uh, where am I supposed to go again? Maya, that was it. Yes, I'm evil. Stone split gaps, what's this way? Mole bear moors ahead. Beware mi wild mole bears. Uh, 
Nothing to do here. Okay, so I gotta turn back. That's really nice. You wouldn't see that stuff in the SNES version. Yes, they're evil, especially that certain one. Oh yeah, were you here for the very beginning of the stream? I want to show you something. Watch what you could do. But uh, no, I'm not talking to. Uh, I bought your bird past the pasta. Oh my god, really? Thank you. So check this out. Mixing is kind of weird, though. Get the cheese! to increase your HP and stats like your strength. With increased stats, you can use training points to power up your characters by learning moves and abilities. Put points towards the abilities from the training section of Plus. As good as it is, though, I have to... As good as the original soundtrack is, though, I have to play with the remake soundtrack. I've already done a stream of this game with the original. are still a little like I'm, I'm not a big fan of the textures they're kind of low quality but then again thinking about F secret of mana remake this is still like leagues better uh, how do I uh... look I should be able to more peck powers Oh, you get, like, bonuses if you defeat enemies quick enough. That's cool. V4, what was that purple guy that you had, uh, emojis of? Twitch icons or whatever. I'm guessing that's just a default, uh, thing. You're, like, crackling? A limited time event. Oh. Oh, that was CS, uh, CS meter. I hate saying CS because that's what we used to call my department at work. Because it was customer service. Then we changed it to customer experience. 
and I thought it was like... I was just like, oh cool, does that come with the pay raise? It didn't, and I was pretty upset. Then I got transferred, and now I'm much happier. That happened a while ago, though. I, I mean, it's, it is good news, and I'm willing to stick with it for now. in a row there. This is pretty fun. I could just, like, st stand in this area and just fight. Yeah, the rabbits do sound really cute in this version. They also respawn really quickly. How does this work? I have three training points. Quick heal. Status effect time shortened by 30%. Effect length increased by 100% for status increase caused by move. Base intellect increased by 5. Damage CS boost adds 2% of CS gauge when receiving damage. So everything plus 2 when everything is good. Strength counter. Attack increases by successfully updated download. Wait, what? Pokemon Shield had an update? Hold on a second. Oh, you know what? It's all bug fixes. I remember, like, every Pokemon game is getting, like, some sort of bug fix right now. Um, attack increases by 10% for 30 seconds when receiving damage. Effect cannot overlap. HP plus 10, that's also really good. 50% chance of not getting knocked back. Let's let's do two of these. You must equip the learned abilities in order to use them. There are many types of abilities. Some will raise your stats, some help during battle, etc. Go to the gear stats menu and try equipping an ability. Oh, I see. So you can only have two abilities now, and then when you get a class upgrade, you could probably get two more, and then another two. Useful. <laughs> Map just ends in a black void. Stone split gap. Some more popping right there. Traverse stone split gap. 
Nice foley work with the foot sounds here, by the way. Ooh, that sounds actually, that's nice. That sound actually like traverses your ears. Game is extremely generous. Remember when I was playing Second and Tattoo Three, like the original version, and my controller just stopped working in the in the middle of the uh, the jungle area towards the end of the game, and I died because of it. That was fun. Just you wait, Crimson Wizard. I ain't gonna stop until I'm more than powerful enough to take you down. You won't get away with this. King Crimson and the I Lizard Wizard. I will defeat you. Is that the end? Yes, it is. Bested by the Crimson Wizard, nearly lost confidence in his skills. He set out for Holy City Wendell to gain the strength to overcome his failings. The Sacred Incestor 3, the Hunt Down Evil Harry Potter game. Wait, is that seriously the whole demo? I thought there was going to be more to it. I thought there was a boss fight. If I had the time, I would go through it again with a different character, but I also feel it's not really worth it. I also feel there's a lot more setup than actual gameplay in that. Like, I thought I was screwing around too much in that, uh, more bear pass, but that ended up being the whole thing. Though I guess since you could play as all six characters, you kind of get the beginning of all their stories. Which is pretty cool. Unless there's more to this. Uh, maybe there is more to this. All right, never mind. We're still going. Chad belongs to Ferolia. Don't resist, and we may spare you. Ferolian forces have taken the town and closed the docks. Now my docks. ship's stuck in the harbor until who knows when. Socks. Chad's been taken? 
What are these beasts been up to? Rolling forces have taken the town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already know that. I'd love to throw them all out of town, but there's only one of me. Oh boy, another town for me to just <laughs> ransack. I'm not scared. I'm scared. You with those invaders? Well, you could get out of here with the rest of them. Floating in midair. I use these item seeds. Yes, finally he gets to take a bath. Don't bark if you can't handle a bite. It's Kev. Shh, shh. Don't tell them I'm here, okay? Can't be found out. I am one of them, but not with them. Can't let them see me. Don't tell. <coughs> Please? Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. That's not what I imagine you sound like. Honey elixir sells for 25 gold. It's a full heal, damn it. Oh, I never equipped my better weapon. Or never mind, maybe I do have the better weapon. Oh, yeah, please. <sighs> Keep your head down, and you won't get hurt. Look at my pets, damn it. That's <laughs> oh, shit. I'm helping them vandalizing the town. Quit gawking and get lost. The beast men want to take over Wendell. Someone's got to tell his eminence, the priest of light, before it's too late. Stop, I beg you. Eek, leave me alone. Quit gawking and get lost. I just said that over there. Oh, is this the dude who makes the cannon? No, that's a different place. We're dooting hard with these trumpets here. Oh, 
another customer. Sorry, we're fresh out of weapons. Couldn't stop those beastmen from taking the lot. down and you won't get hurt. Yeah. Pipe down, pup. Isn't there like a secret? There's a secret path out of this inn, right? I think that's what it is. These beastmen are too frightening to fight. It is better to hide. This town is caught up in a war it never wanted. It's the same story everywhere you go in the world these days. Like my homeland. What on earth is going on? like humans during the day, but at night, they transform into animals. Don't leave the house after dark, you hear? Hey, if you're trying to leave the city, <coughs> night is actually best. Once the beastmen transform, they lose their better judgment. Hmm. The whole lot of them tend to get together and brawl amongst themselves until dawn. It's easier to sneak out of the city then. Good luck. Trained swordsman knows when to pick his battles. Yep, I'm just gonna say that out loud to no one in particular, just to sound impressive. Pardon me. My younger brother is missing, and I must find him as soon as possible. Have you perchance seen a little lost boy around here? I see. Thank you, anyway. I haven't seen him. Or maybe I have, I don't know. If you do see a lost young boy, please tell him that his sister is searching for him. Welcome. Well, you're welcome in the shop, but I'm out of equipment. These men are ruining my business.
pocket and get lost. Oh, there I go. Hey, magic rope. Looking for a place to rest? No charge. Can't do business with the beast men in town. No, they're furries. <coughs> I better hope they're staying cool inside those suits. Let me tell you, when I wore that suit, it, uh... What just happened? Echo Give there. The girl some peace and quiet. Back off. Damn. The sass is real. You can't get anything past me. All of them. Stop this herb, medicinal herb, ton oil, chocolate, spirit serum. Spirit stat increases by one, limited number obtainable. Ooh, that's cool. Better use that on someone with a good spirit. Has magic damage done to an ally. Nice. Spell any magical effects, okay. Don't want to waste that in Duran. But yeah, when I went to uh, Texas a few weeks ago, it was to wear my uh, my costume, my new costume. And uh, it was pretty uncomfortable, not gonna lie. Wait, they told you not to go out at night, and yet all these people are just standing here. Are the scary people gone now, Mama? <sighs> I suppose the stories of Beastman changing forms were true all along. I can still hear them outside the town. Where did the Beastman run off to? They all ran off so suddenly. Something's not right with the town. Watch yourself. Hey, Fryman. Hey, Duran, you gotta watch yourself. Wait, wait, what's up here then? If I have to go down there... to do here. Just break my legs real quick. <laughs> if you get hit hard during a battle, you could select from recovery items or moves that will partially or fully recover for party's HP and MP. Remember that you could use these out of battle, too. Yeah, it's something that Dragon Quest XI did, where you could do, like, partial...
head to Cascade Cavern. Oh, these are enemies. Shit. Just imagine exploding into bones when you die. Jad Stronghold. Where our friend come? Isn't the uh, doesn't this game have the turtle? That's what that's what we ride around on, right? We get like the flute, don't we? Oh yeah, the- so, another thing that's interesting about this game is the enemies themselves have levels, so you could fight Rabbi to later, they're just like level 30. They're not so cute then. Assassin. B plus A or X aerial attack. Okay, you can't hold a charge in the air. Side Town Astoria. Oh, hey, lols. Uh, demo's pretty good. It's a little... Uh, technically, on the technical side, it's a little, like, funky at times. Some of the graphics are kind of weird. It's popping. But, uh, the game runs smooth. The battle system is better than the SNES version, in my opinion. And the voice acting is pretty good. I would say the voice acting is on par with, uh, Square Enix's work. The demo's actually long, also longer than I thought it would be. I've been playing it for almost two hours. Uh, so I go left or right? I will say, I wish the running speed was a little faster. Just because the, the game the game is a lot bigger, so you're moving at kind of a slower pace overall. Like, 
Lakeside Town Astoria. I think Cascade Cavern is the other way. Wait, who am I fighting? Oh. Cascade Cavern, Holy City Wendell. Okay, so that's where I gotta go. But the question, the real question is, is that certain song in this game good? I mean, I'd have to hope so. I don't think I was supposed to come here yet. Side town of Astoria. Phantasmal light will bring the destruction of the town. What an ominous thing to keep in your town as a decoration. Feels weird here. still hop on the fortune teller's countertop in his hometown? No, but he did uh, make some very, very exaggerated gestures towards the, uh, towards the fortune teller. It was really funny. He, like, the, w the way they, the way he reacts to what she says, he, he just, like, it, it just seems so over the top. Like, he makes these, like, like, points at her like he's gonna kill her. It's really funny. You hear? Jad's been taken over by the Beastmen. Are we next? Maybe. Uh oh. It's Lumina time. Okay, just glitch right in there. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Ooh, an iron sword. Oh, good choice. Quality. Don't ask me to sell my bronze sword back already. Oh, come on. You could do better than that. Oh, maybe I can't actually sell the bronze sword back. Oh, yeah, I can. Never mind. Bye, dad sword. Literary's interaction with that fortune teller is most what I remember of Duran's intro. It's pretty exaggerated here, so yeah. it's memorable. And jump in the water.
empty storage room. Interesting. Money real quick. Why is Panta acting up? She's usually so calm. Same stuff everywhere. Come again. I'd rather just save the money. Side town Astoria. What a nice town. I'm sure nothing bad will happen to it. Mm. Oh, of course, can't buy armor. down here. Here it is. Welcome. Oh, you could just save. I forgot you could do that in ends. Projectile. Wolf fiend oil. Boost chance of critical hit. Projectile deals not projectile deals non-elemental damage to enemy. So, it's just better to do the charge attacks all around, then, to build up that meter. But I already have a full meter, too. This game's not too hard, honestly. I don't want to do this. Because I'm, I'm afraid it's going to make it too hard. Not be changed during battle. Oh, wait. I might have to crank it up to hard, honestly. See how much harder it is. Ah! <laughs> 
I'm definitely taking damage more often, but it's still not that bad. <laughs> I might leave this on hard for now. statues do. There's a point to them, though. Tonight, too. I think that statue is the key to getting to the small people town. I think you're right. Please, no kill stuff is too cute. definitely happens slower in this game. So I have two training points. So I can either put two more in- wait, can I- Oh! So it's cumulative, okay. Break armor. Normal attack's better at breaking armor by 50%. Honestly, I don't know why I wouldn't go for that. This is for beating them quickly and beating them without taking damage. It's really cool. I was gonna say, isn't this cave blocked off? There's an invisible force blocking the way. This barrier looks pretty 
sturdy. You better ask. <laughs> That animation of him falling down is really funny. It looks way too slow. Oh, well, good thing I've already explored this town fully. <coughs> I could just get to the meat of this and go. I managed to get away from Jad, but now I'm stuck here because of this barrier. Now I'll never get home to Wendell. Take down the barrier? Hey buddy, if you figure it out, let me know. I'm gonna spend the night here, I guess. Finding a way home is a problem for future me. You could stay the night here too. Maybe the barrier will magically disappear overnight. You never know. able to go through Cascade Cavern to the east to get to the other side of the lake. Uh, unfortunately, Wendell's closed it off to keep their city safe. Head to the inn. I don't know why, but I feel compelled to head to the inn. <laughs> Forgot about this. I see. Sleep well. I recall this light not being good. Mm. Huh? Or maybe it is. I don't know. Stand here and stare at it. My eyes aren't playing tricks on me. You saw that light too, didn't you? Well, I'll be. What? <sighs> the heck was that light? A monster? Finally! Something's happening in this town. Maybe that light will give me a proper fight. <laughs> That's not Bryce Pappenbrook. Oh my god, talk to him. Stop. I knew it. I told you I saw a light. Oh, yeah, now I remember what happens. It's an evil omen. A story and legend say that a phantasmal light will bring destruction of the town. We're doomed. Literally what it says there. on hard, right? Yeah, I did.
And the light kills everyone. <coughs> oh wait, no, it's a uh, Sylph or whatever hey, the name is. Hang in there, little tiny woman. from Valsena. The name's Duran. I saw the light from the inn in Astoria. I see. Oh, I have no other option. So I suppose you'll do. Hold on. What? I'm going to inject you with poison. Oh, never mind. I'll tell you later. Please. I need you to take me to the Priest of Light in Wendell. I can't fly any further on my own. I mean, that's where I'm headed too, but there's a barrier around the cavern. We're stuck here until further notice. Sorry. I can get us through the barrier. But we need to hurry. Something has happened to the Sanctuary of Mana. The mana? Sanctuary Ooh. of Mana? Wait. Not liking that. Whoa! What was that? It came from Astoria. I gotta go back. I wouldn't. Oh, we need to get going. Let me rest inside you for a bit. You won't see me, but don't worry. I'm still here. That's creepy. Whoa, 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 wait, wait, what? Don't delay. We must see to Astoria. Ah, she's talking in my head. Oh, that's so weird. Hurry! Jeez, so, fine, on it! It's a bit weird to hear him, like, speak candidly like that. <sighs> Take Fairy with you. So, why are you heading to Wendell? I need to get stronger. That's why I gotta find a way to switch classes. Haven't had an easy time yourself. I almost feel like that's sarcastic. I think I'm gonna do is um I'm gonna after I finish the demo I'm gonna save it I'm not gonna upload the VOD until right before the game actually comes out because it's still over a month away I think it's April 24th this comes out so I might do is I'll save the VOD for like the day before it upload it and then start part two wherever this ends off what happened where is everyone 
Because the data does carry over. This looks like the work of beastmen. Those cowards! There is no time to waste. We have to get to the Priest of Light as soon as possible. Oh, Wendell is in danger. Head back to Cascade Cavern. Let me just loot the uh, remains of the town first. So brutal you can't even see the bodies. Yeah, these definitely regenerate. Because these weren't here before. Also, the town boundaries aren't really clearly defined. You have to use the mini-map, which you could turn off if you don't really want it. Magic girl. Ugh, if this barrier were in the way, I swear I'd be in Wendell by now. <laughs> it's not fair. Oh, how about that? Uh, you say a fairy's gonna help us get inside? Oh, you must mean the light from the forest. I am so glad she's your problem and not mine. <laughs> wow. No, thank you. Super sassy. So is she gonna let us in or what? Oh, and you can help me get to Wendell, by the way. I could use a break. You can ex you can experience the previous journey of your new companion, Angela. Play through their past. You cannot save during a flashback chapter. Any obta items obtained during the flashback will be lost. Oh, cool. So it's like bravely. It's like uh, Octopath Traveler. Uh, I want to, but I also feel like this. Like I needed this. Ah, uh, whatever. Not an hour. Since items don't matter here, I could just blast through it. That's cool, so you at least get to experience the beginnings of all three characters. In Altena, the kingdom of magicians, the true queen's magic was all that kept the freezing temperatures of the surrounding snowy lands at bay. But, as the mana of the world grew weaker... Ugh, don't so say mana. Her power. It's mana. Bit by bit, the ice and cold began to encroach on the castle. Citizens, we all feel the magic draining from the land as mana weakens. For our mighty kingdom of Altena, this is of grave concern. We shall not sit idly. She sounds like such a nerd. Crumbles. No. No. We must open the forbidden portal to the sanctuary of mana. And then we can obtain That's the next game in the series. Sword of mana. 
I thought that we tried to manage it. I thought we tried to manage it. I thought we tried to manage it. I thought we tried to manage it. Be still. Legend says the portal to the Sanctuary of Mana only appears after activating the Mana Stones throughout the world. Obviously, no country would willingly give up a precious Mana Stone, so we expect a certain amount of resistance. We shall muster our strength and take the Mana Stones by force. Our true queen will obtain the Sword of Mana to rule her magic empire! Long live the true queen! Glory to Altena! Oh, come on, Jose! Please! Harsh! No need to shout, your highness. Look, it's the same NPC Honestly. you see in every town. You know... I used to be the sharpest of the great magic users in the Altanish court. Yeah. Whoa, 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 hang on. I do not need another trip down your winding memory lane. Just teach me the rest of yesterday's lesson. Ha! Okay there, Noelle. <sighs> I've told you time and time <clears throat> again. You cannot mm. use magic simply by learning the steps. Your magic has not manifested because you rely on form instead of spirit. Oh, please, not another lecture. Fine, I just won't ask for lessons anymore then. How's your hair doing Take that? that? Oh, this child. I'm sure she'll overcome that lesson in just a second, so she can use magic in battle. Look, there's Victor. Let a hunk. Hey, Victor, hey! Oh, uh, warning, your highness. What a Have dork. Have you finished your magic lessons already? You know, Jose complains to me whenever you skip lessons, right? Please consider my plight next time, Your Highness. Nah. Angela, princess and heir to the throne of Altena. With a heavy burden dogging her steps, Angela grew up fatherless in the shadow of her mother's royal duties. Her childhood was extremely lonely. Instead of affection from her mother, it seemed all she received were scoldings. Though she knew that the queen had important responsibilities that kept the two from playing, that knowledge didn't stop Angela's frustrated tears. Starved for attention, the princess grew into a rebellious youth. She often acted out, playing pranks on members of the court. Though Angela became a renowned beauty, much like her mother, she remained woefully unable to wield the magic power of her bloodline. That lack of talent was never far from her mind. Ugh, I am so bored. Why does nothing ever happen around here? <coughs> I was gonna say, does she just roll? No, she can do this. Her dodge just feels a lot farther than, uh, Duran's. Your Highness, Victor was searching for you. There he is, he's right there. Uh, two! It's gotten much colder lately. Uh, these don't matter. Good morning, your highness. It's so hard to get supplies nowadays. There are many monsters between Castle Altena and the port town of Alrent into the east. 
Oh my god. That's annoying. I don't like that. I'm not a fan of that. Good morning, your highness. Offer up a prayer to the Mana statue and your progress will be saved. You cannot save during a flashback chapter. So literally they don't give you any- like nothing of this counts. By order of the true queen, this area is off limits. None are allowed through at the moment. Yeah, so there's literally no point to any of this. It's just flavor text. To get backstory. Your Highness, you're looking lovely today. That jumping noise. Good lord. The true queen is in an important meeting. Something about the fate of the kingdom or some such. The crimson wizard is with her, of course. I believe it's a war council. Apologies, your highness. The true queen's meeting is not over yet. I cannot let you in. Please wait. Why? We cannot allow our magic to be less effective than a common sword. Mental boost! Magic shield! Stand back, your highness. The mages are practicing their magic. Standing on. Oh, there's like a perch. The Crimson Wizard is training the mages harder than ever. I heard some were injured, but I suppose that's one of the dangers of war. I'm not sure. But the Crimson Wizard might be as powerful as Her Majesty the Queen now. Oh, there you are! Uh, Your Highness, the Queen and her advisor have called for you. Uh, I will wait for you in the gardens. Now is not the time to dawdle. His Please voice hurry, actor Your sounds Highness. very familiar. Also, why is he the only boy in this entire city? This is urgent! Her Majesty is preparing our troops to invade Valsena across the sea! We must go to her, Your Highness. Oh yeah, Jose too. <coughs> Head to the throne room. Please enter, Your Highness. Uh, Your Majesty. I believe you sent for me. Angela, allow me to explain. As you know, we must control the mana stones to gain access to the sanctuary and to restore that our popping in textures. For our, uh, invasion. Legend says if we activate the energy of the mana stones in the world, the portal will open. And we don't question legend. Why? We shall begin with the Altenish mana stone. Altenish, Alninish. Uh, how will you do that? We will use a forbidden magic spell, outlawed because it takes the life of the enchanter in exchange for that mana energy. However, 
My associate and I are too important for this sacrifice. If we use your body as a vessel for that cursed magic, your death would act as the catalyst we need to release the Mana Stone Wow, mask off, just being evil as shit, huh? But, 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 but mother! You've been a useless blight on my lineage for far too long. To think that my daughter could be so weak and powerless. Under these circumstances, sacrificing yourself for the spell is the most fitting end for my heir. Now come, my child. No. No. She's gone. Anti magic. Hmm. She teleported herself right outside the town, which was nice and warm, and yet it's snowy here. I think they said that's because of the magic or whatever. Where? I'm outside the castle. But why? Why would my mother? I can't return. I can't return, but I have no idea what to do now. We run to someplace warm. Look how you're dressed, too. Was you would never survive out there. To the east? That might be my only option at this point. Cool, then that's not gonna do jack shit for me. Fish boys. Hoglin. Is the warm area just surrounded by frost? This looks like this kind of vaguely reminds me. Oh, no, the, the desert's not in the same place. I was gonna say, some of this map looks like how it is in Sword of Mana for Game Boy Advance. Oh, I'm going back the way I came. Oops. I'm still in battle, that's why. I find it funny that um, Duran's been training and he's level 1 at the beginning of this game, where she has clearly not been a fighter and she's just as powerful.
See, now I wonder if I'll keep that between uh, storylines. Okay. Oh good, you're awake. My daughter found you in the snowfields. Hmm? We brought you back to Ulrent. Please rest until you feel well. Why does every town in this game start with A, aside from Jad? Our guest woke up! <laughs> Yay! Can I play with her? Huh? Can I? No, don't bother her. But I'll play with you. Yay! <sighs> My child is an only child, so I can get a bit overprotective. I know I shouldn't, but I just can't help spoiling her. Hey, hey, mommy, come here! Oh no! Why are there jiggle physics? Why are they exaggerated? I don't like that. That's kind of ridiculous. She just had dinner, but she forgot already. How many dinners does one person need? When's dinner? I think I'll go for a walk to boost my mood. The ice is spreading into the harbor now. Looks like we won't be able to dock any ships for a while. The last ship is leaving our northern port soon. Yeah, I'm choosing Duran. <laughs> or I chose Duran already. Oh, look, everything's back to like reset the level of the uh, item box or magic pot. Today is Mana Day. You could stay here free of charge. Would you like <laughs> to rest? It's a 
fortune teller. Ma'am, I don't know what to do. Please, give me guidance. How'd you know she was a fortune teller? Sometimes people lose any last spark of hope and fall into the deepest despair. <laughs> when that happens, you must go to Holy City Wendell and seek advice from his eminence, the Priest of Light. The Priest of Light? To find your way through the darkness of despair, you will need a guiding light. Go to Wendell, child. That is your fate. Yep, my third is gonna be Kevin. Huh? Come on! This broad told me the same thing. <coughs> Go to Wendell or whatever. All I asked was whether my next child was gonna be a boy or a girl. You look too young to have any children. You're a child. Yeah, Kevin's gonna be my third, and then um, on the next playthrough, if I do a second one of this game at some point, I'll do uh, Kevin as the main character. Uh, Charlotte as a companion one since their stories are tied together and then I'll do um, I guess either Hawk or high. Hawkeye or Reese for the third character it'll be nice because by the end I'll see all but one uh, intro story I'll go I mean nothing could possibly be worse than staying cooped up in the castle and if I learn how to handle my magic Maybe my mother will welcome me back. There's a chance, at least. I wouldn't bank on that. I also wouldn't learn magic just to impress your mother. Heart heavy with the Queen's rejection. Angela left Altena as a wanted criminal with a price on her head. Are you going to do Kevin's flashback intro the stream if time allows? I don't know how lo much longer this demo is. That's kind of the issue. Mega Man 11 is definitely not happening tonight. Which is a shame. I've been shafting that game for half a year. Angela finished recounting the harrowing... Excuse me. Angela finished recounting the harrowing story of how she came to be on this journey... Wait a sec. You said you're the princess of Altena. Then you must be friends with that blasted wizard, huh? She just explained what happened. Excuse me? Don't even joke about that. That guy conspired with my mom to sacrifice my life in exchange for magic. I hate that jerk. Oh. Sorry. I didn't realize. Then... What's up with that wizard anyway? I mean, who is he? It's Fuck if I know. Years back, he couldn't use magic either, like me. Our teacher, Jose, was at his wit's end. But then suddenly, he was able to wield incredible power. Now, the Crimson Wizard acts as the Queen's chief advisor. And to top it off, he doesn't even call me by my royal title. Can you believe that? Oh, oh my god. So mad. An incredibly powerful wizard, huh? Well, I'm gonna be the best swordsman in Valsena. He won't stand a chance. <laughs> oh, how silly of me. <coughs> I never asked your name. Oh, wait, I don't care. Duran, huh? No, it's Duran. All right, then. Lead on, Duran. Angela joined the party. You can switch out your party Don't keep character. Me waiting. Come on. Don't keep me waiting. Come on. Don't keep me waiting. Come on. Don't keep me Come on. Come on. You just switch in midair. <laughs> so impatient. Give me a moment. I'll get rid of the barrier. Yeah, I've wanted to play Mega Man 11 for a long time, but when it came out, I was still uh, unemployed in them money. And then last year, when I came back from Anthrocon, 
uh, the game was on sale for like 13 bucks, so I ordered it and just got it delivered, and I still haven't played it. And it's funny because last year at Anthrocon, the guest of honor was uh, Ben Diskin, who does the voice of Mega Man and Mega Man 11. So it kind of like all like kind of added up at the same time. He's a pretty cool dude. It's... He... Oh my god. Ben Diskin is like 30-something years... He's like 38, like 40, almost 40 years old. He's young... He looks younger than me. There's a photo of me and him uh, at Anthrocon together, and he... Just, he, he looks like he's in his mid-20s, I swear. He was number one. Now you can. If you switch characters, you just drop. Isn't that the guy who voices Haida and Negretzko? Yep, that's yep. That's why he was uh, that's why he was there. That's why he got invited. He has a Haida. I don't know if he owns it, but he has a Haida fur suit. He wore during the parade. So, you're all on your own out here. Well, as the princess of Altena, I've had training. I'll take monsters over the Altanish forces any day. In that case, I won't worry if we find some trouble out there. You can come with. But, um, don't get in the way of my training. Got it? Oh god, she's making noisy when she's not playable. Oh, she's level 4. She must have more uh, points. Yeah, she does. But her magic armor is gone. Uh... I feel like strength should actually be what I give her, but... What exactly does stamina do? Deals magic earth damage. Defensive magic decreased by 15% when casting. Oh, did you get two from that? Recover two of MP when enemy is defeated. It's actually pretty good, considering that your MP in this game is like eight at the beginning of the game. That's pretty damn good. Break armor. Wait, what? This ability is equipped to Duran. Move and give it to Angela. Wait, what? So if it has that little symbol at the bottom, it can be equipped by multiple people. Interesting. Deals magic-like damage. I can't use it yet, though. You must obtain the requisite elemental's power. Well, at least I have it for later. Oh, he has shields. She doesn't have that. She probably can heat. Well, actually, no. I'll say balanced. Yes, particles, combo attacks, battle bonus after battle, you receive bonuses based on your technique. Yeah. Back attacks. Try attacking enemies from behind when you find them in the field. If your enemy is true, you might get a critical hit with extra power. Be careful of armored enemies because they can't be pushed back and attacks don't hit as hard. Use a power charge attack to break the enemy's armor or else your attacks won't be as effective. Clash strikes work too. Oh, 
menu with plus. Access the map with minus. Different stats can affect different moves. For instance, the intellect stat affects magic attack and spirit attack. Spirit affects healing magic. Oh, okay. If you have a high luck stat, you'll have an easier time with projectiles or traps. Try increasing the relevant stat for improved results. so far. Holy City Wendell. Duran sets out for Wendell to seek guidance from the Priest of Light. Duran, a talented young soldier from Felsena, wins the Kingdom Swordsmanship competition. His triumph is short-lived, however, when a strange intruder attacks the castle during his guard duty that very night. Chapter, we're still in chapter one here. Holy City Wendell. So what's this way? All right. Uh oh. Funny if I got to the ice cavern and I died again the same way I died in the SNES version. You must have taken out all the enemies nearby. The fact that there's no lock on in this game is kind of annoying. I feel like the aerial enemies kind of need that. Wendell is ahead. That's very ominous sounding. That's new. Switch his time to day or night. Oh, cool. Charlotte, or Carly, as she was called in the SNES version, as I said earlier the stream. Uh, Holy! Ooh-woo. Oh, I thought it was a grana, but you saved me! 
I'm Charlotte. I'm a famous beauty from Wendell. Ooh, woo. Hey, beauty or not, stay away from legends, okay? It's dangerous. She'll be a secondary character in my next, in my second playthrough. to look into something for the temple. But I got a really, really bad feeling about it. Can I save videos from this? Yes, I can. I didn't want anything to happen to Heath. So I followed him in secret and didn't tell Grandpa when I left the temple that night. Notice is your mana. Oh, well, what's this? By a horrible twist of fate, Creepy looking man took Heath away. Why would I finally Oh, found that him fucker. <laughs> I forgot who that guy is. It. I hated having to read her stuff. I should have honestly saved her for, the vo for this voice actor remake. No. See the priests of light anyway. You can come with us, but don't get comfy. Come on. Oh, you want to see Grandpa? Why didn't you say so? You didn't know it, but you helped your chances. I'm actually the granddaughter of the priest of light. The priest of light? But you know, Wendell isn't She's far cute. from here. You might need my help getting there. But I don't need your help getting home. Take care that you don't get lost. Bye bye. Interesting that they give you her backstory, even though she's not going to be playable. There she goes. She was a strange one. I will say I'm enjoying this a lot, and I think that um, overall I'm gonna like this more than the original Seiken and Setsu 3 when the full version comes out. Because the thing is, I felt like the original, I felt like both Secret of Mana and um, Seiken and Setsu 3 boiled down to a lot of button mashing. Even though the game tries to be more strategic than that, this game pulls it off in a better balance. Because it's still button mashy, but the game also doesn't punish you for being button mashy. That's kind of weird, though. I hate how it just stops you to do that.
Spring stepper, danger, faulty spring stepper, no stepping. I sprung step. Wait, does she not show up? Do the other party members not show up if there's no enemies? Holy City Wendell. Stratosphere oh, launching spring steppers uh, that you could casually look at a world map. Come on, let's find that priest of light. Thank you so much for taking me here. Hurry, we need to request an audience with his eminence. Oh, I guess the other party members don't show up, uh. You're just in an area with no enemies. That's kind of weird. Yeah, I don't know. That's a good question about the spring steppers. I don't know if uh, there's like map viewing ones because there is just a map now. There's Astoria. Well, there was Astoria. Rabbite Forest. Cascade Cavern. Stone Split Gap. Mulbear Moors. Wait, where's Jad? Isn't that up here? Troubled souls from across the world have come here to Wendell seeking guidance. We are a neutral town and have no enemies. Cat. equipment and weapons here in Wendell. If only the world had no need of such dangerous tools of violence. Cat, 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 cat. <laughs> I mean, those spring steppers had the novelty of showing off Mode 7. But we don't need that anymore. Now we have Mode 89. You have heard of the Priest of Light, of course. You must seek his wisdom after coming such a long way. Are you here to see the Priest of Light? The temple is beyond the town square. Alright, I've got a question. How do you, do you... Does anyone know how much longer this demo is? Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Ooh. Stiff leathers and silk robe. Oh, good choice. Looks good. Oh, good choice. Maybe until the first boss, the crab fella. Nope. When is the crab boss, anyway? <laughs> Come again. That's still like another dungeon away, isn't it? And I get my third party member before then. Wow. 
I'm so glad I consulted with the Priest of Light. Now I can hold my head up high when I return home to my country. Barf, barf. Down a different path. Oh yeah, it's that other path, but I still... Uh, hmm. What a beautiful day. We are able to live so peacefully here at the foot of the temple. Yes, but his eminence seems out of sorts the last time I saw him. Have you seen a little girl in a floppy hat? Priest of Light's granddaughter has gone missing. She could have become some monster's dinner. Say... There I was, barbecue sauce on my titties, in the most serious voice you can muster. Holy City Wendell. I already talked to this dude, didn't I? Sorry, we're closed until the evening. Come back later. Alright, I should come back at night. Oh, man. Look, I was requested. I can't not say it. Also, hey, Gamma. Oh, oh. My chest is kind of hurting, though. Yeah, this is the Trials of Mana remake. Or the first version of Trials of Mana, I guess. And remake of Seiken and Tetsu 3, however you want to put it. Heath, one of the temple priests is so cool. His eminence's granddaughter, Charlotte, is missing. Everybody's talking about it. The Temple of Light is north of town. Am I okay? I, I don't know. My my chest kind of feels weird. There's some pain in it. I don't know what's going on. Swords are so cool. I want to be a sword master when I grow up. Hmm. What to do? Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. Oh, Saf. Good perfect. choice. I'll make use of this. Again. Is this even out yet? Nope, this is just a demo. Welcome. Lots of wares to browse. I don't really need any of those. Come again. The monsters in Cascade Cavern are more docile than a man a day. Damn it, now even I'm saying it that way. That's the day of the week when most people travel to Wendell. Recently, monsters have been particularly ferocious, even on Mana Day. I had seen travelers in quite a while. I mean, it's called that, I might as well say it that way. If you're going into the cavern, you should buy some of my grandpa's magic rope. It'll save you if you get lost. And it's made of hemp, so you can just, you know, blaze up whenever you want. Don't push yourself too hard. Ah, uh, thanks. I'm actually probably going to stop here, because I don't know how much longer there is in this demo. Because I still have another backstory to do, and I'm at three hours now, so... Uh, what should I do? Be 
beastmen, shmeastmen. We have his eminence, the priest of light. We all protect this land. Ferolia is west of us in a thick jungle. Not even beastmen can get through those trees. That's why they attacked from the sea by way of Jad. Uh, what's down here? such fine weather. I think I'll head to the Temple of Light. Many worshippers come far and wide to visit the Temple of Light. <laughs> Kitty. <laughs> Grandpa's rope sounds like he's trying to hook her grandfather, her grandfather up. You may not have that backstory. I think the first boss you fight is only with two folks. Kevin is most likely after that boss in this remake, too. But yes, stop whenever you deem necessary. All right, let me take a gander. More cat. This game looks a lot smoother. <laughs> no, you get your third party member before the demo ends. This person's playing through with Carly as the first party member, or as the third party member. Yeah, I mean, there's, um, if I do everything, there's, like, another half hour of this, at least. Assuming I don't skip the other story. So, you know what? Uh, what is their other party members? They're, they have the same setup, except for instead of Kevin, they have, uh, they have, uh, Charlotte. So, essentially, they have the first three places you go to is Duran. Or not. Never mind. So I'm going to stop here then. I'll finish this tomorrow. How long have you been at this? About th three hours and ten minutes. Level two. Higher chance of enemies dropping seeds. Seeds have a higher chance of yielding good items. Max incre HP increases by 5. Can I just use it? Ghost Eye. Deals dark magic damage. Chance of instantly destroying lower powered enemies. Leveled enemies. Power 200. Max HP increases by 5, but it only shows the current HP. Got you covered. There she goes. I show up at the butt end of your streams. Well, yeah, I usually stream from midnight till 3. I can't really go later, because there's people in this house that get pissy if I if I go too late. They get, they get upset that I'm even up until 3 a.m. I 
I wanted to get this, but I'm not sure I'm in the mood for a full-fledged RPG right now. I mean, if you have a PS4, just get Final Fantasy VII Remake if you're on the fence. But, uh... That's coming out sooner, anyway. That said, I, I do recommend this so far. I'm having a lot of fun with it. And I know that there's only, like, another 30 minutes or so to go, but... Oh, my butt. Oh, I can't make the time right now. I need to rest. I'll stream this tomorrow before, uh... Before... Ugh. I've been brushed with a roommate who also streams. Yeah, that's true. I'm not feeling too hot. Um, I'm gonna stop here. Thanks, everyone. It's I really appreciate everyone who came out today. Because there's quite a few. Uh, but I have to stop because I'm tired and it's the end of the day. Oh, yeah, that's right. All the uh, Final Fantasy games are lower in price now. Temporarily. But yeah, I'll finish this tomorrow. I'll probably start streaming at like 11. I'm going to do an earlier stream tomorrow. Hopefully uh, I get work ends at like exactly 10. So I don't have to stick around and waste time. Because that's the thing, even though I'm working from home, I still might get caught up on stuff at the end of the shift. So streaming by 11 isn't always doable. Uh, and once I go back to the office, it definitely won't be doable because I, this shift might be permanent. But yeah, uh, n thanks. I will try to take it easy. I'm gonna take some medicine. I don't know what's, uh... My chest is kind of hurting. But yeah, uh, we'll finish this, uh, tomorrow. It should only be another half hour or so, and then, uh, you know, we all, we all know what's gonna happen after I finish streaming this. So, look forward to that. Look forward to midnight tomorrow. Because we're going on a vacation. A long long vacation you guys have a great evening I will see you tomorrow maybe hopefully around 11 p.m. Eastern good night